All right. What is good, guys? Hello? We got more ulti action. And it's like 3 a.m. here, but thankfully I'm still up. So we got Ojan vs. ABR. Nice, nice. And yeah, at the same time, I meant Zilet is still playing for Smogtos uh, vs. Lefties, <laughs> and he's in semi finals. I don't know how the fuck he does it. He brought Star twice last round. This guy's a legend. <laughs> in round one, he won with Gangle in the jungle with um, a Muck, a Gastrodon. Um, and some disgusting Pokemon, a Gudra. <laughs> that was pretty bad. Alright, looking at uh, ABR's team, Keldeo destroys it. I mean, he has Quick Attack Pinsir, he has um, a Coco, he has a. Uh, whatchamacallit? This guy's on Mimikyu, so you can check it out. No, he doesn't really have switch ins. Yeah, he doesn't have switch ins, yeah. And the Magina. Is it AV or offensive? I think it's offensive. Oh. So Ajama scouted for Scarf Gangshot turn 1. Nice play. Spikes was a fine play anyway. Um, it, I think it's Sash or Scarf Grand, I'm not sure yet. I'm guessing that's AV Mag. Oh yeah, I haven't looked at Ajama's team, let me see. Uh, Scarf Lari or Scarf Kelio? And then Zemo of Coco, but it will also be Zemo of Kelio if, this, if the Lari Scarf. Yeah, no, I was saying ABR is probably his AV. Yeah, yeah, no. Maybe Ojama's too, oh. I don't know. Oh, ABR's. Uh, I guess the. Mimikyu could be Z move. Now, the Coco's usually almost Z move, almost always Z move. Yeah. These Ooh. Days. Okay, that's, I think, AV. I think this is Z wild charge then, if you just brought it in like this. Yeah, I'll always U turn here on the Lando. Potential Lando. Because mm. the wild, Z wild charge kills Majora. Unless it's and some general run defense on AV, but that's not that common, I think. Yeah. Oh, I mean, if he specs and he clicks HP, I see that's also nice play. Yeah. <laughs> um, does Ojama even have a good mid ground play? Not really. This is Coco's just hard to deal with. I say Lando is the best. If you turn C on the land though, um, then he goes Gren, I assume. Mm -hmm. I don't know if the. I wanna know if the Gren is Sash already. Give me the information. <laughs> it's not confirmed. But uh, Gren seems like the most likely Scarf on ABR's team. I guess Lando could be Scarf, but then he's a. Yeah, Lando could be Scarf because he has quick attack pins of a Volcarona. True, and Mimikyu's uh, disguise. But not 100% sure. Nah, the land of the only oh, rock. Yeah. I don't like. I don't like scarf rocks. Yeah, so he didn't scout for it. Ojama got him. I mean, you say you can say he didn't scout. You can also say he just predicted. The U yeah, sure. I mean, it's hard to say. Like, I mean, I would have always U-turned there. So if I was my opponent and I know that my opponent likes to U-turn, I would stay into. Um, yeah, I don't think there's a scarf now that I look at it because it's the only <laughs> rocker. I'm not sure anymore. Yeah, he got his rocks up. So it's either Scarf or he just doesn't have a Scarf. Uh, he has priority and disguise and stuff. I definitely think ABR is going to spike again. I mean... I think he's just aggressive like that. I think Ice Beam is fine here. I know the Magirna yep. is like so obvious, but the Magirna takes hazards. Mm -hmm. Actually, the Magirna is really annoying if it comes in here. <laughs> the thing is, a lot of you can't defog on like anything, pretty much. That's the one problem with Magirna, um, yeah, 30 with I think. The one problem is that, that he doesn't have, that doesn't have any recovery, like it just gets chipped. Okay, so it's Sash. Yeah, that, I was just about or to say, it's probably that Sash, that said that um, Brof is used in World Cup. Ice Beam, Spikes, Dark Pulse, Toxic Spikes? Or Taunt? I think it's T. Maybe. Sp could be T Spike. Alright, so it's just gonna SD here. And you probably get a kill. Um, he doesn't really need the Magirna for. Um, I guess it's nice for opposing Magirna, and it's it's nice for. Yeah. Uh, now Coco kills it anyway. I think after has that with a regular wild charge probably. Yeah, definitely. Got my computer's lagging. Hmm. I just feel like Ojama is uh. Ojama needs to defog because his Coco, he needs his Coco for the pincer. 
and hazards aren't helping at all. Yeah, but ABI's team is like built this way that you can't really defog on anything because they're all pressure here. Yeah, ABR doesn't even have defog. Like, the Coco probably has taunt, the Magenta would kill the Ladi, so like you don't defog for free on anything. Yeah, true. But yeah, it's, it's Although not, if the Coco gets like 50, it's, it it's dies probably, to plus 2 quick like, attack. It's like worth sacking the Ladi later on to get the defog. Bro. But yeah. now he has to worry about the Mimikyu first. Like, Mimikyu would be like super bad if it didn't have this nice ability. Mm, if it had a... Bolts. Oh, actually... Hmm. He's defensive Lando. Oh, his red card. Yeah, that's pretty cool. That's nice. It also prevents setup, so there's like another thing that prevents setup. Hmm. That... You think you think he would uh, sneak here? I mean, what does he lose from sneak? Does it kill? Yeah, not much. Yeah, it definitely kills. Like, it's not live up, and this one is kind of weak, so I'm not 100% sure. But Ladi has kind of bad defense, but I'm gonna call it real quick. Yeah, okay, this 57 if it's adamant. Oh, fuck, I just. I clicked on my own video that I was watching in the back. Fuck. Um. Alright. So, John's probably just gonna go land, though, right? I mean, this still, takes, this still takes a lot. Yeah. Yeah, like, I don't think maybe I had to predict. Yeah, but if he Shadow Cloud, he died to play rough. Um, if Defensive Lando probably doesn't even kill this with off quick, but I'm gonna cut real quick. I think it does, actually. Or it's close. Looks like the 70 to 84. Ooh. I don't know about the SD play. Does this kill? No, that's, re that's really good for him. Oh, I, I I thought I'm not sure if it kills after SD. I thought two player roughs kill guaranteed. Or no, I doubt it kills. Two shadow. But it weakens it for um, pincer. Yeah, like if he shadow claw twice, I would have done more. Or if he's play rough twice. Yeah, true. All right. So I'm guessing the play is to. I mean, if pincer gets an SD, does cook attack kill the coco? I don't think it. No, it does not, like 50, not, I think. Not yet. I think there's like 44, something like that. The the arrow 8 nerf coming in handy here. Yeah. And not in handy, the arrow 8 nerf is a bit annoying. He's gonna go I hope it's um, uh, shift gear mag. But it doesn't look likely. If he has HP ice, he can go Coco here. Yeah, Coco's fine. But he might be that you don't watch as Taunt reset. Coco probably brings in. Um... So he's Max Beat Majona confirmed. Otherwise, he would never bring this in. Or like fast than the Lando. Scarf, maybe? <laughs> Wait, it's fast? What am I saying? No, if Lando runs speed, it always outspeeds yeah. Max Beat Mag, but it's defensive Lando. That's what I meant to say. Yeah, he probably knows the speed. Yeah, I think you have to run like 140 speed on Lando or something like that to outspeed Mag. I don't really remember. Mm -hmm. You can just ice beam here, and nothing really like revenges it, unless it's um Z wild charge. If he's Shuka, he can shift gear here. Oh, he's oh he, he's, he's probably Z move. You think he's Z move? Yeah, he's like Cox. Oh, I thought I thought the Coco was. Oh, uh, yeah, earlier I thought the Coco was yeah. Yeah. But he's not lefties. That's what made me think that it's a Z move. Yeah, I'm not sure. I kind of think this is just like AV though, because his lately switching is like. Where are they? Oh. I mean, his team is just offense, like... He just pressures yeah, offense. Yeah, but Scarf Lele still. Yeah, he just pressures offensively. But yeah, it makes sense. Mm -hmm. Now that I can see ABR being the one to bring offensive flash cannon. Hmm. Yeah, Z-Move on Coco obviously makes more sense, but... I mean, AV is kind of still offensive depending on your spread. Like, he outsped the Lando, so he's not AV, right? Because Magena runs speed. Like, I AV guess he thinks it's Scarf. But does AV Magena run speed? It doesn't, right? So this has to be some sort of offensive. Yeah. Like, that's the only... Um, the does robotics. this kill? Ooh. Okay. Um, so that doesn't really do much, though. I want to calc if it's... Um, I want to calc if that's... 
No, I'm I think sure that's I think AV would have done like six, would have taken less from. Yeah, yeah, that's that's definitely not AV. Maybe it's Shookerberry. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. Okay. Although it's probably Scarf Lottie now, and that kind of just wins. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Psyshock here. Yeah. Um, Lando lives with Psyshock, I think. That should. Does it? It's at 50 at the rocks. Psychic. Oh, definitely Earth. not that. It's a different story then. Oh yeah, Psy Psychic also does more to Pinsir, so it's better in this scenario. That this... Is this a roll? I think maybe if Ojama sacks this right now, then maybe Coco can win. I mean, I'm cocking for the kills. God, I hate this. This, this The cock doesn't have the set that I wanted. Psychic does 50, 90, 70, so it doesn't kill, so... Yeah, this is just a free return. Mm-hmm. I mean, if Quick Attack kills... No, I don't think there's a point in SDing because you get revenge by Coco anyways, yeah. Although if he's Adam and Pinsir... Just kidding. <laughs> we see what happens. A real play would be, be still here. See, that game is still going on. 6 versus 5. Lefty's probably winning. Yeah. Now oh, the sweet comes at 14, though. That's pretty good. <laughs> Alright. Mm -hmm. So what do you think O'Jama is going to do? Sack the... Oh, yeah, sack the Magirna. Yeah, the Magirna because probably. I don't think it does much at this point. Ooh. Oh, it's Specs. Oh. No, it's Specs. Oh, fuck. So is he Scarf Coco? Oh, is that Modest Scarf? Does that kill? Modest Scarf is not pretty sure you, you always yeah. need 10 <laughs> if you run Scarf. Some sort of damage boosting item. Wait. I don't get the way. Is this Coco hmm. Scarf? I think. It, did this Coco come out? It didn't come out, so I think it has to be Scarf Coco. With Brave Bird or like Wild Charge. So, like, otherwise you just lose to Volcarona. To like a well played Volcarona. Yeah. I mean, he doesn't just lose to it, he has the Hydro Vortex that does a lot, even through a Spadaf boost. But if Hazards go up and kill the Dust to Gear Drain, like if Spikes. Wait a minute, does, does, does ABR have a chance here? If he's not Scarf Coco? Yeah, but it has to be Scarf Coco, like otherwise this team is just bad. Oh, Jamas? Yeah, it has to be Scarf. Mm. I mean, does Saka, Saka kill? No, it doesn't. I think so. I assume there's like 25. Thunder about that. Wait. You don't T bold. So eight like, HP is in but last move taunt roost a dazzling gleam. Hmm. Yeah, I think if he quick attack the uh Lottie he had a chance. Yeah. I mean he obviously didn't notice that. Yeah, that was really that was a really uh good game. Yeah, I did not expect the Jama to win. Like, well, we all know ABR is best in the losers bracket. No, I mean, like I didn't expect him to win when I saw the matchups, but yeah, we will see in game two now. Yeah. We're gonna make Lottie, this, that's cool. We're gonna make this a nice and long video. Um, all all games in one series uh, in one video. Hopefully not too long now. Wait, I think see that just forfeited because Steve Angelo said thanks a lot. Yeah, see, that's just forfeited. <laughs> Wasting a lot of time until 4 a.m. <laughs> On 4. He got a lot of points, though. Yeah. Like 5 or 6, I don't know how Smoke Tours works. I think I like 6. Mm, yeah, so like... So I have to play my DPL game, because we have to replay it, but otherwise... I kind of want to play Smoke Tours tomorrow. But there's like... So what so happened? Your internet just went out? Yeah, my internet died earlier. I recorded my game, so I've proved that I didn't like DC on purpose. <laughs> I mean, after I got, I had the game won anyway, and then I got double crit. I had really good matchups, so it's gonna be annoying to rematch. 
Mm. Okay, we can pause it till game two stars, or is it already going on? Let's see if, uh, is it the finals now? Um, the finals is Steve Angelo versus... Updates. This is best of three, right? Oh, I don't know. I know that you have to that they play they play three games and as much as finals when there's when there's three players oh, everyone three plays people. each other but this time it's only yeah, two. I think so it's just best of one. I think it's yeah. Left so this is smoke this finals, I can click on that. But see like you look at this, this is the team that left these board in semis and now Steve oh. brings it in finals. <laughs> Steve has started ready. too. Yeah, we're gonna watch the area game at Yeah. Okay. What the hell? Duck Tree DNC. Victini, is that Z Victini? Look at his Victini, look at his Z celebrate Victini counter. I think Toxapex lives ahead and can haze it. No, it doesn't. If it's at full. If it's at full, maybe. Nah, it I does like... one time, it was like 88. Oh, I didn't run, run the code. Toxapex. But yeah, this is, uh... Hmm. Could be Sash Doggy and then Zemo Victini, but could also be Scarf Victini and uh, Zemo Doggy. Uh, what's the Lando's purpose? I think the Lando could be off played. Huh? This team is so. I just don't know. This team looks so confusing. Yeah. Maybe that's too good for me. I'm, I'm getting like thrown. I don't off. like how 5 out of 6 are walled by Steel, though. I mean, the Lando might not be walled. I could be Gravity off played. Could be SmackDown off plate. Yeah. Um, if it's off plate, this pack's dive to Earthquake because they all run Spadev at the moment. So Lefty shouldn't stay in mm -hmm. here. Uh, Ojama, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> Boo is pretty free, I guess. What the fuck? Wow. Wow. So it's Scar? Because he didn't care. It did 8%. Yeah, Ojama's a beast. <laughs> Blunder said who gets him up. <laughs> that T spike isn't fun, though. He needs mm. a defog that. I mean, if this is defog, if this has toxic, this is gonna be so annoying. So, toxic yeah. is toxic spikes. Pe some people use that. Ultra Bolt uses that. Mm. <laughs> I mean, the Gengar switch in to, to Spikes, Gengar switch in is like not, not really there. Is sure, it, no, yeah. If it's max, but it's maybe. Okay. That's, that's specs, right? That did nothing. 38, we're gonna call that real quick. I think that's still specs, though. If that specs, Gengar's actually ass. I was considering using specs, but if that if it does that little damage, specs does forty two to fifty. Okay, my bad. So uh, no, unless he's max with a Ferrothorn, if he's max with a Ferrothorn, um. Yeah, Scarf does twenty four to thirty three. I guess it's just yeah, max with a Ferro takes thirty eight, thirty six to forty two. Yeah, so it's probably max with a. Or he's like mm -hmm. a spooky plate or some other item that I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, that is not good for. It's, that's, uh, that's no set, yeah. Secret specs. It's not good for ABR unless he's pursued Dougie. So he's gonna like leech a knock. Yeah. Gets him up. Whoa. It's kind of just in his head right now. So he's gonna sack this. Uh, whoa, what? What? It's Scarf. Why did he sack that? Okay, I thought last got Lando dies to specs, but Wait, this is, is this really specs that did nothing to Lando? I thought Lando. I'm kidding, that did 77, bro. I thought Lando takes like 95 from specs. Like, uh -huh. Lando has bad, not the best speed death, and I think it's offensive Lando. Maybe he was bluffing Scarf? No, yeah, Lando is Scarf. And it's actually just max HP? Lando's Lando Scarf. Um, no, but he, that was rocks on the other thing. Yeah, he's U-turn. I think that's just... I don't think Gengar's that strong. He's U-turn here on a Celeste dealer. Trust. Trust. Yeah, Gengar's not that strong, I just overestimated. I just thought it would do more, so... I mean, I'm gonna just... Yeah, that, was just a, that was just a really low roll. I'm gonna just cut that real quick with Lando. Yeah, Shadow Ball to 74 to, eight, to 87, okay. So did you turn off? Thank, please tell me. Bro, he's in his head. <laughs> Dude, how? Like, I get that Gengar. I mean, a, even uh, after all this, I think Victini can still win this game. Like, I know that Gengar is a big threat to you, but, like, Nojama knows that it's a threat, so, like, he's not gonna stay in there. But it's also just a 50 yeah. 50 type of thing. Kind of like a free seed. Mm. I mean, you can try to pivot into Pharaoh, but it's risky. Yeah. He's probably gonna go to Mew and burn this. 
Um, but this is... I would not let the Gengar come in for free. Um, <laughs> I guess he's just gonna go Pex now. Yeah, Pex is fine as well. And T-Spike or something. But Gengar's like nasty. Like Gengar can come in as well on the... On a Wisp. So that then he would have to sack his Feral land or... Mm -hmm. Um. So that's probably Z move. Bulo or Zygarde? Huh. Yeah, he, I think he predicted the Gengar with the packs. That was a really good play. Yeah, nice play. I mean, we know that this is Scarf and not off plate, so this packs might either off quick, but I still wouldn't stay in here. Oh my god, how? He gets every play correct. So if he if he hazes on a Z celebrate, he's a Dawn. I mean, we don't know if it's Z celebrate yet. I hope it is. I mean, if it's Z celebrate, doesn't isn't that bad for ABR because Jama can haze here. Yeah, if he hazes here, it's pretty bad. Like I don't think Jama is gonna like risk this setting up. I think I think haze is like a no risk because if he's not haze, then like yeah, it's like kind of bolt strike only, checked. Bolt strike kills if it's banded, but that's not the end of the world for Jama. Hmm. Yeah. If this if this sets up, does it just win? Let me see. Does like this, does the star power kill even kill the the, the 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 NC? Yeah, I think it kills the NC. I mean, if it stays on regular, Diamond Stone probably does too little damage. So hmm. I killed the Diancy one time in regular. Look at that. Diancy. Oh wait, he's searing shot at. What? Was that a misclick? Yeah, he's trying to burn. Oh, I think he was just. I think he predicted the haze, and he was just yeah. used to get chip damage, and get the turn on, and set up on the correct turn. If Did he, he sets celebrate? up on this turn, he's a god. Dude, what does seeing what's in seeing shots base power? I don't even know that move. It's one hundred. I don't. Hey, that's actually a lot. Yeah, but as, and it has a thirty percent chance to burn. Oh, it only has eight pp. Hmm, that's kind of. The Tini gets all the broken moves. Too bad it doesn't get like, but it doesn't get some of its good move uh, if it uses celebrate. That's kind of annoying. Yeah. Um. So I th if he set like, unless he gets nah, even if he gets a diamond stone boost, if after he kills the Ferrothorn, Dagi revenges this. Um, yeah. So I'm not sure if Ojama wants that or if he's gonna double out expecting the Ferro here, or the land or the Ferrothick. You think it'd be just four attacks or? Oh, the DNC, it could be Rock's DNC. It's just only Rock, right? Yeah, it doesn't have a Rocker. It's just, so assume it's Rock's uh, in Power Fire then. Yeah. I mean, it I doesn't have, getting up rocks on it the, doesn't uh, have to be in Power Fire because he has Flamethrower Celest and stuff and pot potential all uh, pummeling. But yeah, if he has HP yeah. Fire, this is just a really good turn because he gets Rocks and he gets to kill this. Yeah, but I think you'd want to keep his DNC, right? Oh, you're right. Um, I just talked about it. Well, I guess it's gonna get trapped either way. I just talked about it and now I just forgot about it. Um, nah, I mean, if he goes to Salus Delay here, the Ferrozone just gets super healthy. So I don't know if he wants that. If, if, like, if if, he, if AI predicts the switch and goes for Leech. Which. Yeah. I actually don't think he's gonna do that. That's too risky. I can more likely see it being Earth Power, but I'm not sure. Opposing Toxapex is like, it's not that annoying for a drama because Specs got pressures it, can fish for drops. Oh, that was a gold play, what the fuck? <laughs> I don't know why he knocked there though. I think Bojama predicted the Power Whip or Leech Seed. Yeah. So he knocked Braden the Celestia, I assume, yeah. Wait, why would he SD? Oh, he doesn't have Gyro. Okay, never mind, he's the god. He figured he wouldn't have Gyro. Gyro is not that common on Ferro at the moment. So he's gonna go for the fighting move here. Yeah. So maybe I can decide if he wants to keep this and sack the Lando instead, but the speed control from Lando is nice. And the T-Sparks mm -hmm. is really nasty, like the Mew already gets poisoned before it can defog. I don't get this, like... Everyone Are he just gonna sack Ferro and then just defog or something, or Wisp with Mew? And then try to set up with Victini at some point. Um, I don't know if Iceman from you would kill, so he might not have to run risk the Will Whisper I'm missing. He's not superpower. 
he's, he's not super power. He predicted the Lando sack, but like yeah. super power was pretty free there. Oh, he predicted. Yeah, yes. I don't know what he predicted. Yes, yeah, he has super power. So ice beam kills for me. Yeah, ice beam kills here. Gengar gets a kill after, kind of. <laughs> yeah, I can see your drama going Gengar. Oh god, um, no. I mean, he can, but like... He's been playing really aggressive. I think he can, like, he's in a good position, so he doesn't have to make that, but what the... Yeah, and it gets it all back. Now he has to go Victine. Like, people say RBR is like the best Sun and Moon OU are. And, or like, one of the best, at least. And Ojama's like... Wait, even... wait. Huh? Bro, this sits up now, and I think it wins. Oh, does it? Actually, I think the Zygar eats one. Does this kill? Yeah, he just died. Oh, it's Connor Rakion. Dude, like, Ojama is like not even... He's not even maining this tier, but... I guess it is true that good Jesus people that are good Christ. in Pokemon in general are good in time when you have, if they don't main it. So he just won two over his ABR. Oh my god. But yeah, ABR... That was an, up that was an upset, bro. ABR has gone... Um, He was like in... Whatchamacallit? Loser's Bracket? pretty early like one or two years ago and then he went till he, yeah all the way to the grand finals he lost in finals to alexander Sink i don't think it's um i don't think this is bad for abr at all i mean it's still bad it's not optimal but it's okay yeah i feel like he can make it pretty far even in the losers bracket oh man if sorry gets abr next round that would be pretty oof, scary it's kind of sad to see either of them get knocked out Mm. Yeah. See the lefties game. Did somebody win yet? Oh, the S to finals game. Oh, it looks like Clef wins. Let me click on it. Steve Angelo stayed up till like 4 a.m. because the <laughs> made him wait. So <laughs> <laughs> this come. I'm trying to see where the crit is. Steve Angelo is stall himself, so like. Uh, like a few games. Like I don't have anything against using it, but the game's obviously gonna take longer than like what are you expecting? Yeah. I think this game is. Did you bring a? Did Steve bring a Spectran? Who? Who brought did a Spectran? Did Steve bring a Spectran? Oh, this. I just saw seventy-eight. Something to seventy-eight to a lottie. Well, oh, it's fairy typing. Oh, the Lottie had its typing change with reflect type maybe. Yeah. Um, I don't know left. I know that Lefties uses a uh, scarf trend a lot. Stami's sprite looks so weird when it's fainted. It looks like um <laughs> that pre evolution like from Fortress. Like that weird thing that you get in game when you like knock at a tree thing. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, can't believe ABR went too well. Oh, to you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, to you. Jamma's second team look really cool. Connor Crush Bulu hasn't been used in a while. That's um for Zapdos, uh, Alone Marowak, and uh, Volcarona. What else? Yeah. The team's kind of slow, but I really like it. Oh, wait, he doesn't have a scarf, I just realized. Hmm. Unless he scarfs, I got the sorry special, but that's not. Nah. I don't think so. You, you, you might have been put, um, sub Zygarde because he has the nasty toxic spikes. Yeah. Alright, well, so lefties wins. S tours. He, he has. Um, oh, I didn't see that. Let me see. I was just looking at a Jarmus team. <laughs> I don't know why Steve is so sad. He's, he got second place. Yeah, the second place is really good. Um, so, like, this team is really interesting because it has, like, toxic spikes, Gengar, and DNZ, like, all week to ground. And then he has the grassy terrain. Mm -hmm. And this one one that I don't want to steal this right now, I'm not gonna lie. And then he has this flying mon like Sus either that doesn't get hit unless they have SmackDown yeah. or uh, Gravity. Mm -hmm. Swords Dance, Horn Leech. So yeah, edge. maybe maybe after all Finchin has lists where he ranked the people that signed up for Snake Tour, he put Ojama at like tenth. And I think ABR I guess was proves it. I think he put ABR at second. But yeah, like Ojama was like 10th out of 100 or however that long list, however that long that list yeah, was. Yeah, it was like 100. Um, 
so maybe he wasn't wrong after all because a lot of people were like saying that this makes yeah. no sense but he'd been studying he came down to the teams a little bit like but overall drama played really well i think he played a bit unnecessarily risky with his toxic packs but yeah Earthquake wouldn't have oh yeah true Earthquake doesn't kill it anyway so he was still fine yeah he knew abr was on the on the back in the back so he knew he yeah, was gonna make just some plays. Just Scarf Lando, it wasn't um, yeah. like any boosting item, SD, Elf play. I probably didn't even kill Pax at like 88. Yeah, it doesn't kill. I'm gonna, I'm gonna run the card real quick and then I'm gonna say bye. Um, let me see. Specialty defensive versus Lando. I've got this 88 to 105, but it was jolly. Because this is adamant. Yeah, 82 to 95. Yeah, I guess it wasn't. As risky the first turn, but still, that's like, that's pretty bad. But he got like a lot of, I don't know if I should say 50-50s, but like he got all his turns correct. Mm -hmm. Like shadow balling the the Ferrothorn again, like twice. But yeah, we wait. Did he shadow ball twice and the Ferro went for rocks? Oh yeah, the Ferro went for rocks. Mm -hmm. I think uh, ABI predicted him to switch in a potential knockoff. Yeah, or gyro. That would have done a shit ton. Are you I think, the outro? Nah, yeah, I'm doing it. Nah, I'm like, I'm just want to say that uh, I think he wanted to get the rocks to support the Victini sweep later on. Yeah, but I think yeah, he have been on Zygarde. Uh, we got Young. Um, we had into the Young OU circuit winner in this video. Thank the, you. The new upcoming Jesus God. So um. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's a nah. That's seal. Hope you guys enjoyed. Yeah, she let, she let the 14 year old kid get to round six of smoke tools, which was semifinals. <laughs> And like, one... Let me see how much this does to Zygarde, actually. What? Which move? The store power. Yeah, you guys can so, expect the upload. Yeah. Um, see that brought Gungle in the jungle to smoke to his round one. <laughs> one. Um, with Curse Gastrodon, Choice Bandit, Muck. And my, my, my friend Mora made that team, that's why I know about the team. And we were just memeing and um, we passed it around and people used it. It was kind of funny, Good but team. I think Seal was the only one that won with Gungle in the jungle. Mora got 6 up by Eternal. <laughs> Sir power to 70 to 84. So he needed a bit more chip on it. Yeah, I think you guys yeah. were watching, and uh, I think there's like 7 series left, so we're gonna be back tomorrow with more. Yeah, there's a lot of games tomorrow. And yeah, it's gonna be like all these pretty interesting in general when you see the next round who's in winners and losers bracket. You already can see that. Um, Hai, who was in top 4 last year, is gonna go pretty far because he's still in winners bracket and. He's just unstoppable. And yeah, goodbye. <laughs> <laughs>